All right, I'm in the airport. The line behind me is crazy. Running a little behind, a little behind on my timing. Sure, it's gonna be okay. My update from the airport. Once I get in, I can do some more of this. At this point, I think I ate my edibles too early, about 150 milligrams altogether. I'm stuck in this line. Things are getting a little funny. I really wanted to get through this part. Might not happen. I'll check in with you. Just got through TSA, plenty of time to spare, so, uh, it's gonna be some drinks at the bar to see what's up. Oh, and they're metal and weird looking. Yeah, metal's in there. Uh, the wiring is in there. Nice. Thought that was it for you, dude. You recording? Yep. <laughs> yeah. He knows I don't want camera stuff. <laughs> All right. First stop, Frankfurt. John, and then from where? Where are we going from there? Essen. Essen? Yeah. To Essen, Germany. Something like that. This thing is loose. Whoa. Mm. Nope, not that at all. Oh no, I'm just filming it. It's all good. You can tell okay, me what. So, um, age white Vermont cheddar. Flight's 40 minutes later than we thought it was going to be. Now I'm not sure what to do. Vino Hall, uh, Discover Grade Watch. Discover the little Zinfandel of the pink sort. Now, here in Germany. On the bus, headed to I don't know where. Hey, look, what is this wallpaper? You can stand. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can stand in the 80s palace here, dog. <laughs> yep. Well, three hours away from our rehearsal spot, and then once we get there, it's rehearsal time, work time. Until then, I can go take a nap in my bunk, which I'm considering. I also just love looking out at the road. So. And I realize now, I took a little nap, I'm up, and I'm looking for weed. So, how to find weed in Germany is what we're going to figure out. I'm in Essen and Dumbledorf. We're going to... Dusseldorf? Dusseldorf? We're gonna see how easy or hard it is to find weed, but that is my mission. All right, we're here. We're here in Germany, getting ready to rock. Here is the rehearsal space set up in here. I'm gonna go check it out right now. See if I can find my friends. This is insane, dude. This whole fucking warehouse. Just crazy equipment. Okay, we're a little lost. That looks nice in there, though. Should have asked her where the weed was at. I was gonna ask that last guy, but then he said he was in such a rush. I'm not really sure. Oh, look at this rehearsal room. You brought the PlayStation? I saw that. I had to. Am I in frame here? You can see the whole egg chair? No. Here, take it. It's it just real quick. This thing's awesome. Egg chair. Right, so I just asked three uh, like stagehand type dudes that worked here where the weed is at and they all looked at me like I was crazy and I was like is weed hard to get around here and they were just all like oh yeah so maybe it's hard for them a little discouraging we're gonna keep on pushing on and we're gonna figure it out hopefully Instagram is gonna come through we're gonna use the powers of social media is that open? no it wasn't Oh, well, Greek's coming, but he's talking, so. What are you doing? <laughs> Just gonna be roll. I'm testing this new gimbal. Nailed the pissing me off roll. <laughs> new gimbal, huh? Yeah. But you're excited. I am. It was only 399 bucks. Only 399 yeah. bucks? Yeah. For a gimbal, that's nothing. Greek and I are going to get everyone pizza, did he tell you? I'm gonna try and get marijuana. Because the one thing that that guy told me is he said the best place to find it is at pizza places. What kind of pizza y'all like? Das beer. All right, just got back from a run here in my wonderful hotel room. Let me tell you, the hotels, and like this is a nice hotel in Germany. I'm speaking on my first experience. I have no idea, but shit looks a little bit hood. Like, it just looks old, you know what I mean? Like, uh, see, it's like old ass floors. It's actually a huge suite, though, that I got. I got, you look at it, you got this whole bedroom. Look at it, though, it's mad old looking. It looks like a, and then you come in through here, big ass bed, window. See what's popping in Germany. I don't even, oh, there's a hole in my window. Well, that'll do it. Let's get through there. Just, uh, 
Oh, that's still... There it is. Anyway, one day in Germany down, still no weed. Quite a few leads, so people told me ask at pizza places. I asked at a pizza place, they looked at me like I'm crazy. People told me kiosks, which are like bodegas, they actually say kiosk. They sell like coffee and gum and shit. Asked there today, the dude looked at me like a fucking weirdo. Um, so day two, no trees. Going back to the rehearsal spot where there's a lot of music type of dudes that uh, hopefully can put me on. Some people have hit me on Twitter and been like, oh, you were in Frankfurt. I didn't realize, dude, I came to the airport to bring you weed. I wish I knew what time. I wish I knew because I wish I had it right now. It's about 10.30. I have a lobby call at 11. Then we're all headed to the rehearsal space. Back on the fucking grind searching for that tree. Record! Good. God damn it! I didn't get any of that. Which does that mean I was just recording everything in my pocket? About an hour in, I put it on, I lay down, I'm like, where's my spray? Oh, the driver said no weed. Can't find weed. What? What kind of driver can't find? Yeah, come on. Loser. I got like 90 it? waters in here. Day two. I'm not vaping. <laughs> LJ, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so, at the rehearsal spot, headed out for a little walk. Figure I'd bring the camera. Check out these German supermarkets. Saw some vending machines. I gotta tell you, it's not the same. Some different drinks out here. There's definitely some different stuff I'm gonna try. I tried some scotch this morning. Going to get some salmon. I'm gonna grill up some salmon for everybody for lunch. Do a little dirty urn. Chef dirty urn style. That's the plan. Um, it's about a .8 mile walk from here. Taking it by foot. I got the book bag on, fill it with some fucking fish and asparagus and make some killer lunch. That's the plan. Maybe we'll find some cool shit along the way. That's my hope. I don't know. We'll see, but off into Germany. To Essen, Germany, for those of you who don't know where we are. Essen's not the biggest city. There's not really a lot here, especially where we are. We're at like some dead end kind of factory warehouse area. All right, we're here. This is a supermarket. Now, let me tell you, the hardest thing of vlogging, vlogging, obviously, for me, I hate this. It seems like I like it, but you walk in the store with a camera, it draws a lot of attention. I want to bring you guys in the store to show you what it's about and, like, the differences and stuff, but it's just, like, it's hard to pretend that you're not drawing a ton of attention to yourself. I'm going to go ahead, walk in, act like this is just completely normal when I'm talking to a camera. I actually need a basket. Let's see if they let's see if they have some salmon. We'll go from there. I think the most difficult part is that I don't really understand what anything says. Can't even read the signs in the aisle to figure out what I'm trying to get. Although I have Google Translate, so I'm working on it. Look at this buttermilk. Kind of looks good. Kind of looks good. Last I checked in, I asked someone for olive oil, and aluminum foil is like olive foil. So, alu foil. So they took me to the aluminum foil. I've been standing in the thing for about 10 minutes looking through the aluminum foil aisle like this doesn't seem right. I found the olive oil. Fresh salmon instead of frozen, and some pepper. I think I should be pretty good. We'll see. This has been fun. I thought it would be a little easier, and I, you know, maybe I take for advantage. I assume everybody knows English. It's not Japan, but still a lot of people don't really know English. My phone died. Google Translate is kicking back in soon. Hopefully, I'm going to have to start learning some words. Oh, Bernays sauce, Teddy. Thinking of you, buddy. Got that salmon. There's the spices. Think we're gonna be good. Different cereals here. I mean, they're sort of similar. Cine Minis. Mmm, Tresor. That that looks the best. This lion cereal also looks kind of amazing. Thinking this nest quick for my man's. All right, the line is popping here. Ready to rock. Look at these cigarette machines. This is kind of crazy. Right at the counter. Cigarettes are big here. I wasn't prepared that they don't have bags unless you buy a bag, which I am always for that. Just unexpected. So, of course, I'm the guy online with like 80 items and no bag. I just stuffed a bunch of it in my book bag. And now I'm going back to cook for my peoples. Well, there's the pizzeria. Not as fancy. And I'm rolling up on this thing. It looks like it says condom. I'm like, what the fuck? A condom. But that's exactly what it is. It's the condomat. Welcome to the condomat. They even have a vibrating penis ring, a travel pussy, a mini vibrator. Look at the little Billy Boy condoms. A little happy, happy wiener. I don't know if this machine's still used. 
Looks like they stopped practicing safe sex out here. It's just fucking used as a trash receptacle now. Still no weed, and honestly, I just blew a chance because the girl walking behind me had dreadlocks. Not to, you know, not to stereotype, but usually dreadlocks and marijuana seem to work well together. So she had dreadlocks, she was walking up on me, but then when I said hi, she said she was going to work at the Turkish consulate, which, I don't know, felt like a non-weed smoking type of job and kind of changed the whole vibe of what I thought I was trying to get into. So anyway, that being said, still no weed. Hopefully, I find some weed soon. Because everything else has been great. Just gotta find out this tree debacle. Garbage cans here are like big old bell that have different stuff. Here's the dumpster type things. Yes, I am in awe of the garbage cans. YouTube channel. I'm from the United States. I'm just traveling, so I like to film everything. So. <laughs> That's how you defrost the salmon. My defrost technique. Got this great stove here. Some wieners for everyone else. Take that wiener, bitch. Cooking has begun. Broccoli's prepped. Still defrosting the salmon. Heating up this pan. I thought I was. Yeah, it heats up, but then it just... Never used one of these. Got some rolls. Make some wieners. Ja! Rastafari. It seems like that pan is hot. One hot dog in for my man Zach. Chuck, you want a wiener? Speaking of wieners, there he is. The group. How you feeling, buddy? Better. Yes. Good. I'm cooking. Throw one in the pan for you too. Oh, I just got my belly hair caught in this fucking lemon. I'm the only guy wearing a lemon. We haven't even handed him out yet. I just saw him and got so excited. Wieners. Yeah, but. Oh yeah, it's heating up. Uh, it's getting hot. It's getting hot. It's getting hot. It, it felt like like I could see it, but it just it kept. You should put it on maximum, dude. It is. That's maximum. Yo, yo! This is the best. I know, you bought me the candy this bar. This is the best candy bar ever made in the entire world ever. And now they have. It's the best. Oh, toss the broccoli. Truth is, tour manager's not always an easy job. Day two, 11 p.m., still no weed. I've talked to people on the street in dreadlocks. I was at the pizza place, a guy came in with fucking cargo shorts and a New York Yankees hat. I figured he was the one, wasn't. I don't know, no one, no one's helping me here with weed in Essen, Germany. Tomorrow we head to Belgium. Hopefully Belgium can get me some weed. If not, then we head to Cologne and I'm sure if I don't find weed in Cologne, you guys can just stop following me because this is ridiculous. But I think weed in Cologne should be should be pretty easy. Um. I didn't know they give you these tickets and you can get food and drinks. It's kind of incredible. Eight drink and food tickets here. Eight drink and food tickets here. That means there is 16 different foods that I can try. I'm gonna start asking everybody from every band, from every walk of life. Someone here has weed and I'm gonna find it. Weed has been secured. Well, maybe not totally. I got to get high. Blazed the cell right now. That's a public urinal, dog. He's just pissing there, right in public. Doing it. Holy shit. Touch your face. That's sick. And fucking That's walk so with you. Sick. Yeah. Oh, you're up here. I was gonna come get you. Yo. Shit is interesting. Very hardcore bands. I've seen some people wearing some very weird shit, so that's what I came out here to find. Weird motherfuckers. So, 25,000 people here. It's pretty spread out. It doesn't feel like there's a ton of people here. I don't know. I just thought it'd be a lot more packed in. Maybe we'll try some food. Oh, they're hamburgers. Hamburgers. Oh, they're just like long hamburgers. No, what? That's a hamburger? A Mexicano. A Mexicano? Okay. If I have those tickets, how many tickets is it? Oh, here. Thank you. Sure. Never had these hamburgers. Again, Getting a long hamburger. Uh, with mayonnaise? <laughs> Ketchup? No. Just onions. Sure. Look at this thing. I don't even know what the fuck. It's good. 
up. Very strange. It's like a big sausage. What if the lagarita dicks up? Yeah. yeah. Fat belly. Oh. Uh, oh. Yes. Look at his fucking fat belly. Nice. Thank you. All right. Off we go. After that last encounter, then I turned the camera off and somebody else came and tapped on my shoulder and like ran away and fucked with me. Oh, I realized, whoop. I realized one, that my gimbal wasn't on. And two, I'm just gonna talk to strangers because everybody wants to talk. Ooh, fucking hard music on there. The Jägermeister group looks like it's on fire. Yeah, there we go. People just see this camera and want to do crazy shit. What the fuck? Every time I turn it off, some shit happens. See? See? I've been tickled, I've been poked. There's a girl changing her top over there. I'm not going to cut to that. Oh, oh no, I am filming. My gimbal's fucking up. Oh. See? Film. I was just going to say, fucking riding the pussy. Nice. There you go. All right. Oh, this guy is who we want in fucking video. This is... Oh, nice, dude. What's up? Where are you guys from? Man, I'm here. Oh, here? It's my backyard party. Nice, yeah, this is great. Yeah. What language is spoken here primarily? Uh, Flemish. 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 Yeah. Dirty. I'm dirty earned. Oh, fees. Fees and base. Fees mace? Fees and mace. Fees and mace. Fees and mace. Fees and mace. Fees and Fees and mace. Thank you. And I kept a kleine Piet. What's that mean? I kept a kleine Piet. I don't know it. I have a small dick. No, I don't have a small <laughs> Definitely a different sense of humor over here. Very strange. My weed, and there it is. I thought it was gonna be a half ounce. Put John next to it. For scale. For scale.